2020 was not a good year, to put it lightly. The COVID-19 pandemic reached practically every corner of the globe, forcing countries to issue lockdowns. Millions found themselves unemployed as businesses closed. People couldn't even escape from their troubles at the movie theaters, as the likes of No Time to Die, Black Widow, and Fast and Furious 9 all got pushed into 2021. Match.com seems to understand how uniquely difficult the year was for single people. In early December, in association with Ryan Reynolds' production company Maximum Effort, the company released a commercial highlighting the relatable hope that 2021 will be better than 2020. In the ad spot, Satan strikes up a new romance with a human personification of 2020, and it's a match made in hell. Call me 2020. The commercial is enough to give viewers a serious sense of deja vu, as they watch the couple exercise in an abandoned gym and hoard toilet paper. But as you watch the Match.com ad, you may also start to feel as though you've seen the woman who plays 2020 before. As it turns out, the actress in the Match.com commercial is Natalie Roy, who has appeared in numerous TV shows and films in the past. Roy has been acting professionally since 2005, when she made her first television appearance in the Canadian drama series On the Run. Over the years, she's popped up in various guest spots on a number of TV series, including Blind Spot on NBC and The Affair on Showtime. In 2018, Roy had a prominent role as Claire in the short-lived dark comedy series After, which follows a widower who attempts to start dating once again. The show, which also stars Joshua Schubart and Olivia Baptista as Benny, was nominated for six Indie Series Awards in 2019. Roy isn't just a talent in front of the cameras. She's also served as a writer, director, and or producer on a number of short films. She released a book in 2013 called 30 Years, 30 Lessons, showcasing the stories, dreams, and moments that make up a life as told from the perspective of a 30-year-old woman trying to attain her goals. You can watch a promo she filmed for the book on her YouTube channel. More recently, Roy appeared opposite Adrian Paul, Vivica A. Fox, Sean Young, and more in the thriller film A Beautiful Distraction about people who come to realize that they're living in an alternate timeline completely different from the one they once did. And just a few days into 2021, Roy popped up in an episode of the crime dramedy series Bull, playing a character named Olivia Wright in the fifth episode of season five. It's clear from her extensive resume that Roy is a multifaceted talent, and the Match.com 2020 commercial has introduced her to a massive new audience. After Match Made in Hell dropped, two more ads were released, When Satan Met 2020 and Sneak Peek at 2021. Oh, I've dated much worse guys than him. Much worse. I mean, at least he's famous. The ads have amassed millions of views and a ton of positive praise, with people really seeming to love the irreverent take on the last year, as well as the remastered version of the country pop song Love Story by Taylor Swift that's featured in the Match Made in Hell spot. In an interview with CBC News, Roy had the chance to talk about the process of bringing the commercial to life, stating, I do feel the scripts were so funny and the physical comedy of the difference in size between myself and the gentleman playing the devil was already so much great material that I actually feel like I didn't have to do much work. With so much exposure, expect plenty of good things to come for Natalie Roy in the years to come. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more Looper videos about your favorite movies and TV shows are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.